what's up everybody? Did you know that even right here in Auckland, New Zealand's biggest city, we've got some pretty great waterfalls too? Yeah, for our longer viewers, last year you might remember we headed over to Karekare, which is out in West Auckland. But today we're going to head down south over to the Hunua Ranges and check out the Hunua Falls. Yeah, but first we're going to head over to Manukau and maybe get something to eat. I think we're feeling like Mexican today. Sounds good, let's go. This area that we're at now is called South Point and the reason why we wanted to come to the California Burrito is uh, Yen and I actually used to live in the city and we used to go to this place all the time but then it closed down for some reason and it's opened up back here in Manukau. It's the only store you can find. I used to have a whole bunch of chains of them. I've ordered a classic burrito, chili con carne and uh, Yen's got her chicken quesadilla which she used to eat all the time. <laughs> I can't wait to have uh, Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, thanks mate. No worries, thank you. We've brought our food all the way over here to the Auckland Botanic Gardens and it was only maybe about a seven-ish minutes drive. Yeah, seven minute drive. We've come here a couple of times before to make vlogs, yeah. but what a fantastic place it is to come here and have a picnic With right next to the water. <laughs> Got the gardens blooming. It's nice. Yeah, and thankfully great weather today. So this place was closed at the start of level three, but under level three, step one, which is what we're in now, they've opened back up the car parks. Sorry, the car parks were closed, but now that's open so we're able to come here and enjoy a little picnic. <laughs> Burrito time! <laughs> One of my life dreams is to actually go to California one day, get some of those $1 tacos from the food trucks that you always <laughs> see on TV, because they look amazing. And from our friends in America who talk about them, they sound absolutely delicious. But until that day, we've got California burrito here in Manuko. Let's have a bite of this burrito. Mm. Oh. Bringing back some good memories. Mm. Yeah. This is bringing back all those memories where Yen and I are working late in the city and we're a little bit too tired to cook and you want a well balanced meal. This is where it's at Mexican food. The beautiful beans mixed in with the chili beef and then top it all off with that melted cheese. Oh man. This is such a good, like, classic go to food when you want some comfort in your life. Ah, look at that chicken quesadilla. The other thing I forgot to mention though is that the visitor center is still closed on this current alert level but I remember reading that the cafe is open so you can just get some food from there too and beverages that sort of thing. This is like a Mexican pizza. I think we've been on a bit of a pizza binge. You got a truck right behind you. <laughs> okay say goodbye. Gosh, that's good. I love all the little corn bits, the, oh, it's fall. <laughs> the <laughs> tomato salsa that's in there and it's a flour based tortilla. So yummy, really nice and fresh and it's still good and hot too which is delicious. making our way over to the Hunua Falls now which is just near Clevedon and it's about 30 minutes away from the Auckland Botanic Gardens that we were just at. So this is a place that amazingly Peter has never gone before but I did when we were like in primary so when we went for school trips that sort of thing so that's the last memory that I have of Hunua and I'm looking forward to seeing it again. But yeah, we um, have checked that it is still within the Auckland Level 3 boundary, so we are just close to the edge of it, but we're definitely still within it, so it's okay for us to travel there. literally right from the car park and walking on this bridge after disinfecting our shoes because the Kaori die pack always got to remember to do that 
you already get the amazing view of the Hunua Falls. That was pretty easy, huh? Oh yeah, <laughs> but we're gonna go on the loop and it's only a 20 minute walk. There are a bunch of different paths over here. So we were originally going straight through the waterfall, but we got sidetracked a bit. We found a part which said, upper lookout, eh bud? Yeah, right. Upper lookout, okay, here's Yen. <laughs> Yeah, so you'll get to a signpost very early on that says it's the loop and a lookout. So we just went on the lookout first before we go closer to the falls. Get another vantage point. Nice view, isn't it? What do you reckon? Because it's your first time seeing it. Uh, it looks lovely, like all the waterfalls that we see around New Zealand. <laughs> this one is a 30 meter high waterfall and it's part of the Wairoa River. So yeah, we need to go loop back down and then we can get a little bit closer. Yeah, I think you can't swim at this one either. Uh, I'm not too sure, but there is another walk that's like three hours and that one's got swimming holes. This into a range picture frame right over here, conveniently located, picture perfect, right in front of the waterfall itself. It has been awesome coming on this very short walk, minimal amount of effort for a very good reward right at the end, and it was cool going up to the lookout too. Yen and I have been thinking about whether or not we wanted to do another additional 75 minute each way return over to a suspension bridge, and uh, since it's such a lovely day out today, I think we're leaning towards a yes, eh bud? Well, Peter's leaning towards a yes, <laughs> so I guess we're going. <laughs> about 13 minutes of driving from the other part over to this end of the Hanua Ranges and we found a sign that said it would take an hour and a half instead of the 75 minutes that we read about online. So fingers crossed it's actually a bit of a shorter walk. Guys, I don't know if it's because we haven't been on one of these hikes for a while or whether or not this one's just particularly difficult, but I've got a good amount of sweat formation on my head. What is this? Doing a full on zoom right there, that is a lot of steps. And it looks really steep. I'm already sweating quite hard. <laughs> but okay, let's do this guys. Let's go check out that suspension bridge. First step. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, no way is she keeping this pace all the way up. That's what you said last time too. Okay. Right. <laughs> <sighs> I give her maybe, maybe 20 more steps. Oh, she's doing it. Look at that. Impressive. Good job, bud. Oh, good to see that there are some nice views up here. Yeah, after a few more of those steps, you get treated to this. Ah, oh, lovely. It looks like we have finally made it. How do you think that went, bud? I think it's okay. So we started at about quarter to five. Let's check what the time is It's almost 5.30 now. 5.22. Yeah, so that signboard was roughly correct. It took yeah. us about 40-ish minutes. 40-ish minutes, I think, with a little break too. It looks like a nice view of the dam. Yeah, let's go check it out. Okay. So Yen reckons that this dam is not quite the end of our journey. Well, no, because it said a suspension bridge track, right? And unless they meant the suspension bridge right at the start, there must be another one because we haven't come across it. So we're going to go a little bit further yeah. and see if we can find a sus suspension bridge. <laughs> We just asked one of the nice ladies that was working down here, she's just driving off over there. Cause we were confused, it's like, 
uh, is there another like, suspension bridge down here that we're meant to find? And she was like, ha ha, guys, <laughs> joke's on you. <laughs> the original suspension bridge, which you walk over right at the start, that's the suspension bridge. But what you do get to enjoy is this lovely dam out here. Yeah. <laughs> and she didn't say joke's on you, but it is on us. <laughs> It feels but, lovely. <laughs> yeah, it is a nice dam and uh, it, it has been a nice walk anyway, just being out in the native bush, so. Yeah. Plus plus, got a bit of exercise, can't <laughs> complain. There were lots of native birds too, which was cool to hear. Yeah, beautiful. A pretty sweet day out here in the Hanua Ranger there. Yeah, it's been fun checking out South Auckland, coming over to this dam and this suspension bridge. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, at least you guys know. So if you're doing the walk, that's the <laughs> that's the bridge right at the start. Yeah. But the view is really nice here at the Wairoa Dam as well. Plus, it was a great time having a feed of one of our old places that we used to visit a lot, California Burrito. Yeah, and we hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Even though it is lockdown, it is great to still be able to go outdoors and enjoy nature here in Auckland. Yeah, if you like this, don't forget to smash the like and subscribe button. Drop us a comment. We love hearing from you and we will We'll catch you in the next vlog. See everybody. <laughs> See ya.